Way better. What it do? It's your boy, the one and only. All right. So today's audio book, I call it Working on Yourself. Personal development. Personal development to me is when you look at yourself like a business or an asset, or you look at yourself like a, a role-playing video game, RPG, and you take the qualities you have now and you take your skills that you have now and you take everything that you are right now and you develop on that person. You take the person that you are now and you develop on it. So it could be different things like learning new skills. It can be like uh, brushing up on skills you already have. It can be related to things that are not even skill related. It could be things like qualities, like it could be things like your personality, brushing up on your personality developing a higher sense awareness of yourself and others around you personal development it's a never ending journey honestly until the day you die you can become better in some way or another until the day you die you can always develop on your person there's always a way to develop on yourself so never stop developing yourself Always remember to work on yourself, personal development, develop your person, build yourself into the character you want to be. Anyone who plays RPGs, it's simple. When you start out as the the rogue ninja or you start off as like that one kid or that one person that has nothing, you have to go through all the levels and all the missions to obtain the knowledge and build your inventory and build your skill set and build everything you do in the RPG. It's the same thing here. It's just, this is reality. All right. So where you at? That's where you need to start. You need to start at where you're at in life. Where you at mentally? Like, how, how do you mentally feel? Like, ask yourself that question. Like, what, what bothers you mentally? What affects you? What makes you happy mentally? What what brings you pleasure, what brings you joy. You gotta find out your mental health, your mental state. And then you can move on to your physical state. Are you out of shape? Are you in shape? Do you wanna tone up? Like, these are all different ways to develop yourself. So, physical health. Where's your physical health at? Once you find out your mental health and you find out your physical health and where you're standing at in your life at this point in time, you can move on to your emotional health. Like. How are your emotions? Are they healthy? Uh, are you unhealthy? Are you toxic? Do you let past relationships control this relationship? Like, what? what is your emotional health bar like? Like, think about it like RPG and make it so much simple because, you know, we play RPGs. If you play RPGs, then to make it so much simple to relate your life to RPG if you just think about life like that. You know what I'm saying? Like in GTA, when you start out in GTA, you start out with nothing. When you start out racing cars, you start out with the booty ass Dodge Neon or like a Honda Civic or something. You gotta build it up, you know what I'm saying? Same thing here. It's just, we're actually talking about you, your person and developing your person. So once you find out your mental health, your physical health and your emotional health, then you can move on to your spirituality, your spiritual health. What is your spirit like? And now this can be a dark place to go into because a lot of people don't even want to think about their spirit because they might be out here just having sex with everybody. And you know, when you have sex with a lot of people, no matter if you're a guy or a girl, you're, you're creating a chemical bond with them spiritually. Like you're taking on their spirit and their energy and you're taking on the things that they might not want to tell you about and you're taking on the things that they might not have told you about and you're taking on the things that you know that they're dealing with so where are you at spiritually you gotta realize that we're spirit first before we came into this physical world we were just spirits before we came into this physical world 
to this physical realm. We were spirits. We were just ghosts. So you got to ask your ghost, like, what is your spirit like? Is your spirit healthy? Is it non-healthy? Does your spirit want others to succeed? Does your spirit not want others to succeed? Is your spirit jealous? Like, you got to sit with your spirit and you got to talk to it as if it's another person. That, that's how you develop and figure out where you're at emotionally and physically and spiritually. And then you can even find out reasons why you're in this state. Like if you're mentally or emotionally like fucked up, like you can sit with your mental state and like you can sit and talk to your mind, like mind, like what's going on? Why, why are you feeling like this? Like ask yourself questions like, what is it that made you feel this way? How can I help you feel better? Like, talk to yourself. Like, that's what we gotta really realize. Like, in today's society, like, we're such cyborgs that we forget that we're the original technology. Like, everything that's being created is based off of us. Like, especially melanated people. Like, this shit comes from us. Like, we can do all the things that this technology thing does. No matter what the technology is, if it's a fucking a scuba diver i mean a fucking submarine we can we can swim low bro like you might not believe it now because we came so far away from who we really are and who we truly are but in a nutshell because i don't want to make this video too long you got to sit with yourself we're going to talk about ways you can develop your mental physical emotional spiritual health in another video right now we're just talking about personal development and working on yourself and being aware of where you're at that's what this whole video is about is being aware of where you're at and working on it from there once you realize where you're at within these four different uh categories of of self that's what these really are mental physically mental physical emotional and spirit those are all four different categories of self those are all four different things we need to focus on to be a full human being a fully functional human being who's in control of their conscious mind and subconscious mind that's a lot i can say man so much i can say but you just gotta learn how to build from there man until next time if you like the video hit the like button if you dislike the video, you can suck my big toe on it real. Leave a comment down below so we can talk some more. Alright, y'all. I'm out of here. Peace.